I shared some fun facts about Sarah before the break, and now it's time to reveal which one are true and which one are false. In our game, we call true or false. Okay, let's see the facts again. A, Sarah has a tattoo of the infamous Connor's couch. B, Sarah has three cats all named Tony. Um, or C, Sarah's first girl kiss was with little old me. Okay, Sarah, which one is true? All right, the true one is C. My first girl kiss was with Drew. And now, I'm not one to kiss and tell, but Please do I got it. But I have to say, Drew, look, now I'm like gonna blush. Drew yes. was the coolest person that I ever met. And yeah, and that's what happened. Well, we were supposed to um, kiss on, in the movie, but then we started practicing in the trailer, which was kind of fun. We had to practice, right? It was really just us doing research. Exactly. We were like, oh, I guess we should like practice because we wanted to look good on screen. <laughs> We had so much fun. I remember, I feel like it was in the parking lot in Los Feliz, right? We were like, had that little base camp. Oh yeah. I drove that Jeep and I used to go get like ice cream on the lunch breaks and I was like constantly getting into accidents. I think I had my license taken away on that movie. I remember you like dancing on the hood of the Jeep. And yeah, it was, you were a wild child, but in the best possible way. I was impressed well, and still am. Oh, I am still so impressed with you. In fact, I was like, oh, like, I mean, I loved and watched you on the talk for so many years. I was curious of like any words of wisdom, you know, like any thoughts for me and my new job? <laughs> oh, you're doing such an amazing job. I mean, I think it's a perfect job for you because the people who do the best at it are authentic and you are so you, you couldn't really be any other way. And you're so human and caring and it's just ideal. Are you, are you loving it? I really, I love it a lot. I love it so much. Yeah. And are you able to find time to act and do other things you love or has it been all uh, consuming? No, it's, it's the kids, you know, the kids are on the front burner. And I, in fact, I stopped doing movies for a while because I, I wanted to raise them and, and be a present mom. And then the further I got away from that, the more I had a harder time connecting with it. And I thought, I've got to find the pretty little middle. I, I want to work and I want to be there for my kids. And then this job is, um, as hard as it is, it's good for, for both and, mm -hmm. you know, how do you like try to balance it all with everything you're doing and your kids? Um, I think I just take it day to day and look at where there's time and try to make sure that, you know, when five or five o'clock or dinner comes that no matter how busy the day is, there's that connecting time towards the end of the day, but it's, it's for sure always a balance and some days are better than others. And like Carly, to bring it full circle, you know, think outside of yourself as much as we're all drowning within and around that the 17 year old is out there taking care of helpless creatures and what an inspiration for us as humans, as parents and everything else. Yeah, and it does make you feel so much better when you're able to give and give back and do for others, you know, it does a lot for your own mental well-being. Yeah, and seeing people do good things. Sarah, I, you are just the best girl kiss a girl could ever ask for, and I miss <laughs> you dearly. Me too, same on all, all of the above. The Connors airs Wednesday on ABC.